Hi guys, and welcome to another video by Chum Vegan and Frodo. I know I'm out and about <laughs> and I haven't been too regular lately. But like seriously, I have like the intention of doing a video like every day and then whatever like stuff happens, life happens, and then you start thinking about other things, and then you're too damn exhausted when you come home <laughs> from work sometimes that you just like because you want to deliver good content. But anyway, <laughs> those of you who actually do follow me on things like Strava would have seen I'm just gonna cross the road would have seen that um, I did a 350 like 360k bike ride over the weekend and I actually wanted to do a video on that and it's funny because like it's not even my first ride like I've done a few over 300k bike rides and the very first one like definitely felt like this major as one but now <laughs> now after I've done a 400k like 4.30 or whatever, 4.32 these 300 rides 350s, they just feel like a massive fail and it's stupid, it's so stupid because like I understand how ridiculous it sounds like you're in a bit of goal 100 kilometer bike rides were like such a massive challenge for me and they're such a huge accomplishment but now 350 seems like I'm being freaking lazy and it is so dumb and so unfair to myself it's just like amuses the crap out of me and I actually done a video about it a little while ago or something like about failure or whatever but I was too embarrassed to openly talk about it <laughs> it's just so funny you know what's the funniest thing is watching yourself progress and grow and learn with all of these through all of these like life challenges and things and the reality is whatever challenges you have you probably have them like set up super duper high and that is so cool and that is so awesome but sometimes even though you might be ready for certain things mentally like sometimes things just don't pan out perfectly it's not all the time of course not all the time but sometimes that is the way it is and it's it's like absolutely zero need to feel shit about it like because whatever you're doing it's already like an awesome epic as accomplishment and having these huge goals like I don't know if your goal to ride 100k's if your goal to ride 500k's if it's your goal to run 42k run 42k's like run a marathon or an Ironman or whatever like right now you might not actually like be able to do it L like you know because there's like just so many things even though you feel like you really really can and mentally and physically and you're just ready for it you want it to happen but sometimes it is what it is and it's just like it feels like it's not the right time or it's like too much effort or whatever and it's not a bad thing check out this artwork i think that's pretty cool i've been noticing a lot of artwork around Brisbane and Gold Coast lately and it really reminds me of Melbourne but it's, it's pretty cool and I love the color but anyway like do not feel bad if you have these goals right and you keep attempting them and attempting them and not getting them filled up successfully or all the way 100% yet because what you're doing is you're practicing you're preparing yourself and every single time you're like learning new things you're getting better and, and it's like ridiculous because I was thinking about it and like I just because it's like you get used to all these successes right like you have all these goals like earlier in this year I was like let's do a half Everest let's do this let's do that and I was just like getting all of them and I was like oh shit like I'm freaking superstar <laughs> and like no reality check <laughs> <laughs> you're not fucking perfect and like no one is and we all know that right and we know that ourselves but sometimes we just when we get used to of getting those done 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 we forget what it's like not to quite get to your goal just yet and I think that's beautiful as well I think it's such a cool experience because it kind of makes you more humble draws you back and you can keep attempting and you can keep retrying until you actually get whatever it is you're trying to do wherever you're trying to get and the thing is 300k it's a freaking awesome as ride 350k is, it's epic it's amazing just like because it's not what five or six hundred in one go like 
it does not make it a bad ride. It's still an epic ride. And the thing is, that's what I should be practicing, really. If, for when, not if, but for when I'm gonna start doing the world records, right? Like, because many people can ride 100Ks a day. Not everyone. And not everyone needs to because we're all amazing and beautiful in many different ways and we need to train up and get ready for these kind of things but quite a lot of people can probably right if they try it and want it and were willing to put an effort 200 is like the next level right it's it's just a little bit more challenging but still reasonably doable but if you're willing and wanting like for example indie packers though they were like doing crazy k's a day like three four hundred like freaking no dramas for some of those people and for others of us that are freaking on this planet it is it might be a bit of a challenge at this stage <laughs> to do this kind of stuff day in day after day after day after day so i have absolutely shit time to learn but i'm not actually like afraid of it and i'm not afraid to say that okay cool like i did not get my goal today I did not get where I wanted to get or as far as I wanted to get on my last attempt but it was still an attempt and I'm gonna keep hammering at it and keep on doing it until I freaking get it and it's just like that with everyone and every thing really <sighs> having that strength and courage to say yes okay this was not my goal and I haven't got my goal yet but I'm gonna keep trying and I'm gonna get it because I'm freaking stubborn as F and, <laughs> and I just want it so bad and sometimes it is just like this selfish ego driven want <laughs> and need and not really even something that you maybe need at that point on that like spiritual level it's more like this is what I want and I want it now but really if you think about it long term and what is it that you really need long term and you'll be, be you'll benefit more from long term is it 300k or 200k or 100k bike ride or is it three 30k bike rides in one week or 50k bike rides in one week like having that long uh, long-term goal in your mind and then understanding that it's not all just about the I want this now so can you just give it to me now I think this is like what people my age freaking struggle with these days because like we'll have our little smartphones in our pockets we'll have jobs we'll have like all these different things and we just like live in this spoiled world we want to go to another country we can like swipe our credit card and just fly over there and do crazy shit over there and kind of sometimes understanding that okay you're not gonna get every single thing right now right this moment and it's good because it's going to teach you things about life as well like <sighs> shit like it's ridiculous to me to consider a 350k bike ride as a failure and i know that it's not but the ego side of me goes um yeah it is bitch because it's like not what you were set out to do and yeah maybe it's still <laughs> <laughs> I'm like being so honest here. but like it, it's not like it's not it's fine it's so good and I don't go for even too many 300k bike rides like if you check my Strava stuff out like usually it's like you know 200 was like my norm 100 to 200 when I'm like going for like a longer days kind of thing don't longer day rides and like when I'm working but I guess I can't you can't really be doing 300k rides when you're working anyway like on the working day but anyway this is what I wanted to make this video about and for is that sometimes yes we have like these insane amazing beautiful goals and they're super important and super valuable to have but it doesn't mean that you need to be hard on yourself and harsh on yourself and you don't um, get them from the very first time because not many people do not many people do get everything from the first go it doesn't mean you suck it does not mean that you shouldn't be doing it or you shouldn't be trying it means that it's you're getting you're preparing yourself to accomplish it when you really are like ready and supposed to get it and whatever you're doing whatever like practice this practice runs you heavy they're also teaching you stuff and they're also preparing you for something else as well like what's the point of not riding the whole year like doing zero cycling but just like getting off your ass and going for this one huge insanely big bike ride for one day like what's the point in that right like you're not a cyclist <laughs> sorry like you know 
like you know what I mean though like it's better to have these kind of regular constant attempts and tries and seeing yourself grow seeing yourself develop and work through things over just going off like Ben one ticked off now I just I'm just not gonna like do anything about this and I'm just gonna be super duper happy and everything's fine we're not perfect but we can keep on trying <laughs> all right this video is freaking 10 minutes already so I hope this was amusing enough for you to watch it <laughs> but like seriously don't be too harsh on yourself have epic insane amazing goals that make you work hard that make your soul fry that make you feel alive it's just like awesome as an epic and amazing but at the same time do not restrict yourself and do not underappreciate the efforts that you're already putting in because it can screw you up psychologically be grateful for everything your body is already doing for you and what you can already do and how far you've come because that's just freaking amazing okay I better go back to work because middle of the day and it's not lunchtime but I really want to talk to you and I did it now I can go and work some more and you can look at that out anyway I'll see you again soon miss talking to you every day and miss cycling for thousand K's every day again thousands of K's but that's fine that's life that's how we earn the money to go on those big trips isn't it anyway awesome to see you guys remember to stop counting calories like counting hills Count your adventures, count your passions. I'll see you again soon. Bye.